э, тем не менее, вот все как бы с этим прекрасно. Э, на пять минут раньше времени мы начинаем презентацию университета Луис. Луис – это один из самых престижных учебных заведений на территории Италии и вообще Европы в рамках экономики, менеджмента и очень много различных сфер, о которых моя коллега Сара Кубато из Рима нам расскажет. Это учебное заведение, которое изначально был основан в Риме и в последующем развитии как раз этого университета. Я хочу сказать личный опыт тоже по поводу университета Луиса, раз мы начинаем с небольшим опережением. Помимо того, что это престижнейший университет, что это очень известный университет, что компании очень высоко котируют э, диплом университета Луис, я хочу сказать, что это, одни, наверное, одно из самых красивых учебных заведений, в котором можно учиться. Э, помимо того, что это находится в Риме, и Рим не нуждается ни, ни в каких представлениях, это в том числе университет, который находится в таких красивых э, знаний, что на самом деле, я думаю, что у студентов э, весь первый день э, проходит исключительно, вот, как бы, действительно, вот, поднимая глаза и голову, и осматриваясь вокруг, потому что это действительно очень красиво. Я так понимаю, что Сара сегодня будет говорить на английском языке, презентация mm -hmm. будет на английском, без перевода. Um, как, как удобно. Как удобно тебе. Мы делаем. Ну, спасибо, спасибо большое и всем привет. А, а сейчас начнем на, на английском. Сейчас минуточку, пожалуйста. Окей, okay. начнем. Uh, so, as I mentioned, the presentation uh, today uh, will be in English, just for the sole aim to be able to be uh, to give more uh, and more extensive information in a shorter time. So, Louis University is a top private university located in Rome, uh, in uh, uh, the capital city of Italy, with whom the university has a very strong connection. Uh, in terms not only of career outcomes for the students, but also in terms of activities organized uh, for its students. Um, the university holds privileged partnerships with the business community uh, through its partnership with Confindustria, which is the Italian Confederation for the Entrepreneurship in the country, and with the institutional world and the legal practice, as Rome is the home to um, different institutions, national and international, like the embassies of different countries, but also of uh, uh, international organization uh, from the UN uh, network. What makes Louis special is, uh, without any doubt, its teaching model, which is called uh, inquiry-based. Um, what does it mean? It means that uh, the students will be uh, able to have a, a perfect combination between the theory and the practice. So you will be invited into uh, a true participation during the lectures, like uh, through programs and uh, through project study groups uh, and different kinds of activities. This is made possible thanks to the extensive experience of our professors in research, but also into the business and uh, institutional world. So our aim is to educate not just students, but also a responsible professional uh, immediately ready for uh, the business world and their career. Uh, for our students and their families, it's always super important to know where the university they are interested in is positioned in terms of rankings. Starting from the national point of view, uh, the private university's uh, ranking from Sole 24 Ore has us in the number one position in the whole country. Then moving to the international point of view, Let's take a look at the QS World University Rankings, which is probably the most famous and notorious uh, ranking. Here we are top 25 uh, universities for the Department of Political Science and top 100 universities for the social sciences. While um, uh, this uh, ranking, which is the EQUIS certification, where we are in the top 1% for business and management, is more related to the quality of teaching, thanks to the um, business um, cases that we always promote to our students and the practical approach that we have. 
And then uh, there's the EU multi ring 2018, which instead speaks about the internationalization uh, of the courses and the opportunities for the mobility of our students. Last but not least, the Financial Times rankings. We are in the top 100 um, in the world for business and management, but not only, uh, because this year we um, uh, earned uh, 25 more positions. So now we are uh, in the 53rd position in the world. Some numbers to give you a glimpse about the university and its activities. As mentioned, we are uh, a social sciences university. Therefore, we offer four areas of expertise. The area of economics and finance, then business and management, political science and law. Therefore, you will not find courses like biology or medicine because we preferred instead to uh, be uh, like faithful to our tradition because since our foundation in 1976, we have been uh, um, giving to our students courses about these spheres. The university is medium-sized. Therefore, we have uh, almost 10,000 students. But what is really um, extraordinary about the number is that despite the number is not too big, we have 85 different nationalities among our students. And 89% of them uh, graduate on time. But how is this made possible? Thanks to the extreme attention and care that we give to our students. In fact, in the, each class approximately, the ratio between the number of professor and students is one professor every every six uh, students. And this, of course, is, is translated into a non-existent abandonment rate because the students are helped in any of their needs. Uh, the internalizational uh, aspect is crucial for us because we always try uh, to transmit to our students the importance to have uh, an international experience and uh, uh, like uh, thinking uh, way of life. So we start from the double degree programs. Basically, it means that you study uh, half of your path at Lewis and half of the path at the partner university and earn a double degree. We have 58 of them and you can choose from them. Or if you prefer to uh, spend a shorter period of time abroad, we have still um, 315 agreements with other universities in 50 some countries. So it's just a matter of choosing where you would like to go. And then uh, you can basically go anywhere you like. We always try to uh, transmit the sense of uh, uh, multiculturality to our students. For this reason, uh, 54,000 of our alumni work worldwide, and the 95% of them uh, is employed just a year after their graduation. Since we are a private university, we actually can give to our students some extra attention and care. Starting, of course, from the most important topics, which is uh, the visa and the residence permit. We have a dedicated office for that, which is the uh, welcome desk. You basically uh, will be contacted by the welcome desk after uh, finalizing your enrollment, and you will be provided with all the guidance needed. The same applies for the housing service. You have two options at Lewis. One is to um, dorm, uh, is to rent uh, a room in our dorm, which can be paid in case your scholarship does not include the dorm. Or you can also share a flat with other Louis students, and we have a dedicated service for that. Uh, in order to settle uh, and like uh, living the Italian experience to the fullest, we also have Italian language course, uh, which is absolutely free of charge for our students. They are not mandatory, but still, it is always an excellent opportunity in order for you to facilitate your everyday communication. From the didactical point of view, we always uh, try to uh, support our students as best we can. Uh, we have the tutors, which is uh, an excellent team of uh, uh, students and professors that will help you not only in uh, um, uh, helping you with uh, like choosing the subjects that you would like to take, but also if you have any obstacles in uh, uh, like uh, succeeding in an exam, we also have the academic gym, which is the dedicated service for that. 
And then uh, let's take a look at the more general services. The canteen, of course, which is open both at lunch and dinner every day. The green mobility, which is a car sharing service dedicated to the students who drive and would like to keep driving uh, abroad and have an international driving license. The buddy program, where uh, an older student will help you in uh, integrate uh, within the new environment, knowing the activities and the opportunities for you at Lewis. And the psychological counseling, which can be either general counseling or uh, we have a service focused on the cultural shock uh, issues. Uh, it is important to mention once again that all of these services are free of charge for the students. Let's take now a look at the uh, courses available at Lewis. We will start from the bachelor's degree. This is a list of the courses available at Lewis held in English. As all the um, uh, courses in, Ita in Italy um, at the bachelor's level, they have the duration of three years and they will give you 180 credits. As you can see, we have basically a course belonging to uh, each of the departments that we have. The courses are uh, innovative in their kind of organization because they are not like the traditional courses in economics or political science or whatsoever, because the aim is always to educate the students in having a mixture of skills. And for this reason, you will have an interdisciplinary approach starting from the bachelor's degree too. As you can see, the kind of uh, exchanges that you have are both structured exchange, but also combined degree programs like the double degree or the triple degree. For further information, you can either contact Studiare in Italia or you can also visit our website. We also have this information on our brochure available at our, web, at our uh, booth on the website. Also, uh, we have the page related to the master's degree. In this case, the um, uh, offer is divided into the residential offer and the digital offer. Regarding the residential programs, basically the ones held on campus, we have the areas of business and economics and the areas of law and politics. As you can see, the list is quite long. So it means that you will have a very wide choice in, uh, uh, in your master's degree studies. Of course, the courses have uh, different majors that you can choose from. And in case you will not find the major which is feasible for you, which is interesting for you, you can still personalize your, um, your course. As for the digital master's degree, these are the two novelties from last year. Uh, they are the courses of marketing and strategic management. What is innovative about this course is the, the methodology, which is called OnLive. In fact, here you will be able to attend the lectures from anywhere in the world, um, but you will be taking your exams in Italy. Basically, uh, it is like a, a blended formula that can give you the flexibility and the rigor of our courses. In any case, the kind of certification that you will get, both from the residential programs and the digital programs, is absolutely the same, entitling you to pursue your career or start a PhD if you wish to. This is the QR code, uh, because of course the list is quite long, so you can either scan it or, if you prefer, visit our booth um, on the website. Let's move on to the admissions requirements. The process for the international students is pretty easy. Uh, first of all, I would like to specify that the call for application is not open yet, as it will be around the next uh, two weeks. In the meantime, you can, of course, start preparing your documents. Uh, the students eligible to apply are those who um, already finished their uh, high school or bachelor's degree, uh, not earlier than 2020, or those who will obtain their high school diploma or their bachelor's degree by the end of July, 2023. What do you need to apply? You will be uploading on our website the most recent academic transcript showing the course titles and their GPA. If you have not finished yet, then you will just upload a provisional transcript. The email address of a sponsoring professor. By sponsoring professor, we mean that it is someone from your school or, or bachelor's degree who can give a reference on you. Other optional certification that you would like to upload or um, language certificate. Um, 
which is the Italian language proficiency for a B2 uh, level. If you studied or are studying in English, then it is not needed. Uh, you can present a certificate from the school or the university stating that you attended in English. The certifications that we accept are uh, IELTS, TOEFL, uh, but also the Duolingo. <clears throat> For the bachelor's courses, we also have a direct admission channel, which is the um, the most uh, like the quickest way to be admitted to the bachelor's degrees. Um, you can do that either uh, presenting an SAT certificate with a minimum score of 1,090, either an SAT certificate with a minimum score of 20, or an IB diploma with at least 30, 35. The same applies for the master's degree program. Uh, also here we have like the quicker way, which is the direct admission through the GMAT or the GRE. In this case, uh, you will be presenting either a GMAT certificate with a minimum score of 550 or a GRE with a minimum score of 145. Um, let's take a quick look at uh, the scholarship. Uh, several scholarships are awarded to the international students every year. Since the university is private, the kind of scholarships that we can offer are merit-based. Um, they can be partial, meaning that you are entitled to receive a discount on your tuition fee, or full scholarship. And in this case, you are entitled to receive an exemption from paying the fees. Um, to be eligible, you just need to apply because uh, uh, you will be evaluated at the same time for the CT in the course and for the merit-based scholarship too. This is our uh, the context that we have. So you can reach us out anytime. Thank you a lot for your attention. Thank you very much, Sara, for your presentation. Спасибо огромное за презентацию была. Очень интересно услышать всю информацию по поводу университета Луис. Один, как мы говорили, один из самых престижных университетов, которые есть на территории Италии, Европы, в тех сферах, о которых вы слышали во время презентации от моей коллеги Сара Кубату. Есть вопрос от студента. Значит, I'm very interested in the, in the triple degree program in business administration. Am I supposed to apply for this program from the beginning or maybe it is possible to do so during my studies? Thank you for the question. Uh, so uh, you will be required to apply for the triple degree program um, starting from the end of your first year. So you just apply for the traditional business administration course through our application form. And then you can think whether you would like to participate in this triple degree. Of course, the triple degree will have some requirements, like you will be um, required to be on time with your exam schedule. And of course, you will be uh, participating into a selection. In case you will be uh, selected, the degree will be conducted in collaboration with the Renmin University in Beijing and with the George Washington University in the US. Very good indeed. And uh, uh, also there is a question about preparation for the entrance test. Do there is any mock test? Some so uh, the university does not uh, foresee any admission test because the selection is either um, title-based, so with the traditional evaluation of the background, or the direct admission with the SAT or uh, ACT or IB for the bachelor's courses or uh, direct admission with the GMAT, GRE with the master's degree courses. Very good indeed. Um, and uh, if uh, the student has a bachelor's degree in linguistic with English as main language, mm -hmm. they still need to provide a language certificate. So if you attended the whole course in English, then yes. Please keep in mind that for those students who have a slightly different um, background from uh, like the, the master's degree that they would like to have, 
uh, the admissions committee may ask you to take some additional exams in order to fill the gaps that you might have. For example, since you uh, graduated in linguistics, if you, for example, would like to enroll in the course of marketing, just to um, make an example, in that case, the admissions committee could ask you to uh, have some additional exams. Okay, that's very good. And also, there is a question from Yelena. Um, does the university admit merit-based scholarships as for state universities? Or maybe there are some merit-based scholarships that you can suggest. Mm -hmm. Okay, so for the merit-based scholarships, the one available is the Lewis scholarships that I mentioned in the presentation. In any case, for those students who prefer to apply for, uh, for example, the regional scholarship, that is possible. You can apply for that scholarship and then uh, you just uh, inform the, the university in case uh, you will be awarded with that. While for the merit-based scholarship, it's just an automatic process. Okay, thank you very much. I guess uh, it's uh, all, it's everything uh, with the questions. 